So a few summers ago, I had these great plans that my yard was going to be cleaned. Not just like mowed, but really fixed up. I even got my kids outside to help me a few times. On one such occasion, I had convinced my kids to do some weeding along the side of the house. And after a grand total of about five minutes, one of my boys walked up to me telling me that he had found something amazing. With a look of pride on his face, he lifted his hand to show me his treasure. And it was a dead bird. Of course, this was really sad and gross. While at the same time, I'm trying not to react because he didn't know any better. I told him, thank you for cleaning the flower bed and that we should go wash his hands right away. But I'm sure like, sometimes I do this with God. I open my hand to him, like, anxious to show him what I think is something wonderful that I found or done or learned, and maybe having good intentions, but really not knowing what I'm doing. So it makes sense then when Psalms 103 tells us, as a father has compassion on his children, so the Lord has compassion on those who fear him. My son didn't realize he was bringing me a dirty and diseased dead bird. And even with the best of intentions, our gifts to God, they aren't that much better. But he looks at us with a heart that's full of love, compassion, and forgiveness. And he wants us anyway. So bring your best to God. And while you are, be thankful that he loves us, like, even when we don't know what we're doing.